Hi guys, I'm Vanessa from the social media team here at Birchbox. Today I'm here to tell you about my current favorite products from Birchbox.com. I picked these five because I feel like they're the five products that have totally transformed my beauty routine. The first one I'm going to tell you about is probably the first color-based cover-up I have ever been addicted to, and that's Jouer's Luminizing Moisture Tint. If you have a similar skin tone to mine, I use the shade Deep Bronze. I use it a lot through the summer. So in the winter, I could probably stand to go down a shade or two, but I mix it, this is a pro tip, with a cream um, moisturizer to lighten it a bit and I can use it all year round. I love this product because, as you know, it has. there's another product that they have that's matte, but I have, I'm always on the side of shimmer. I wanna glisten, I wanna glow. I know some people prefer a matte look, but anything that gives me just like an extra oomph or like a shine, a dewiness, I'm all about it. And I love this because it's not too much coverage. I know a lot of people crave coverage, but it gives you the coverage without that thick coating, which I can't stand, which is why for most of my life, I didn't even wear a cover-up, even though I probably needed one. So this is the way to go if you're looking for light coverage that really does the job. Next, a product that I wear all year round as well, it's Lock & Co's Lip Lube in Minotaur. And hear me out on this one. I first got this in my birch box, and you can see here I have used it a lot. I got the sample size. This is the full size that I purchased from birchbox.com, but I do still have my sample that I carry in my clutch when I go out on the weekends. I love this because it's a product that shocked me. I got it in my birch box and I was like, uh, purple? and I didn't know how I felt about it because I had just stepped outside of red lipstick. For me, it was always gloss, red, or nothing. I tried it on and obsessed. I'm wearing it right now. I wear it in the summer, spring. Another reason I love it is because I suffer in cold weather months with chapped lips. But I love this because on days when I want color on my lips, but I don't wanna feel dry and cracked, Lock & Co Lip Lube's the way to go because while it's giving you that pigment that you really want, it's also giving you moisture. Next, I'm gonna tell you about this little guy, Temp2 Highlighter. This is Champagne Shimmer. And if you have my skin tone, this color is gonna look great on you, but I've also seen people with lighter skin tones use it, and it also looks great on them, so it's very versatile. This is the sample size, as you can see. You can purchase it for full size on birchbox.com. I got this months ago, I'm still using the sample size. Just to let you know, I don't wear it every day. I do rotate my highlighters, but this one's my favorite. I love the consistency. I usually dab it on the top of my hand so that I can control the amount of highlighter that I'm putting on and I take my fingertip and I dab, dab, dab. I'm not gonna do it right now because I'm actually wearing it. And I dab in the places that I want it and I blend with my fingertips. Sometimes I use my beauty blender. Next is the cleanser that I'm using currently, Suki Exfoliate Foaming Cleanser. A little backstory about me and skincare. I'm currently obsessed. It's probably my favorite part of my beauty routine. But before I worked at Birchbox, and I've been here for about a year now, I was not great with skincare. I used an over-the-counter brand that I cannot even remember right now. And I can't even say that I wash my makeup off every night. I know that's like cardinal rule number one, but I didn't do it. I've been lucky enough not to have terrible breakouts, but my skin right now is most definitely in way better condition than it was before when I wasn't taking care of it. For me, exfoliators are risky because of my sensitive skin. Some, some I use and I honestly feel like it's burning my skin. What I love about Suki is right when you feel like you're at your limit and you can't take any more of the exfoliation, it snap like that switches to a cleanser with a foaming consistency and you get that like you're relieved it's like okay I'm done I've done that part and you can use it every day which you cannot say about a lot of exfoliators it's usually like once or twice a week last and I have to warn you this is my splurge favorite this guy is worth every cent that it costs I was introduced to this of course via Birchbox my first day here I walked in and a sample of Caudalie's Premier Crew eye cream was on my desk. Never in my life had I used an eye cream. I thought it was merely for anti-aging, which I'll tell you now, I've already started an anti-aging regimen. It's never too early. So I didn't even use it probably until about a month. And I was like, all right, I'm gonna take all these samples home that I got on my first day and I'm gonna try them out. So I started using this for about a week and I have dark circles, they're hereditary. It has nothing to do with like how tired I am, how awake I am, they're always there. So I was like, you know, maybe this can help 
lessen their visibility. Maybe it'll just like, I've heard about like hyperpigmentation. A lot of people said maybe that's the reason your dark circles are more severe or less severe. So I'm like, I'm gonna try this out to hydrate that area a little bit more. After a week of use, I immediately noticed that my eyes are way less puffy, which is something that is dictated by my sleeping schedule, so that was amazing. And no, my dark circles didn't disappear, but they didn't contrast as much from the rest of my skin, which was really nice to see because I just had sort of embraced and accepted the fact that it was always gonna be a part of my appearance. It's worth it if you wanna invest in your skincare. This is my top, my favorite, my go-to, my goals. Totally, love it. Those are my five favorite products from Birchbox.com right now. I use them religiously. Ask me any questions I didn't answer for you in the comments and tell me your favorite products because I always love trying new products. It's one of my favorite things. Bye guys.